This shit is fresh out the oven. Fresh out the oven. I'm back in this bitch. So, we're back here once again for another edition of Fresh Out the Oven. This time, we got this guy from North Carolina named Daquan M. Bain. I hope that's how you say it. Is it either M. Bain or Mo Bain? I don't know. But I'm put it, all that stuff. But, yeah, he got this new project or whatever. Actually came out like, what? Actually came out like two weeks ago or whatever called 1641. So, I don't know how it's going to sound or whatever. But I'm pretty confident in the guy or whatever because I heard this song he made called Letter to Cole. So I'm just going off that. But this should be a great project. Letter to Cole? Yo, what's up with all y'all Carolina niggas and J. Cole, man? Man, J. Cole, the Carolina GOAT. That's so, y'all daddy or something, nigga? Man. I'm just playing. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so without further ado, we finna get into it. Daquan yeah, Mubane, 1641. Let's go. So the first song we got is Prelude. Boom. Yo, uh, oh, best quick shout out to like the album cover. I like, that, I like the album certain. cover. I think it's a uh, very I'm interesting. To the Ray to it that you could get from it, you know. Back in my day, we had all the good rappers out. I'm on my way home, check out this little documentary, 1641. Documentary. <laughs> just can't seem to understand each other, and I made this here just to try and see if it'll help unite us and stuff like that. But, you oh, know, we still on the same track. That's the only gripe I got so far. This shit is too long for it to be the uh, intro slash skip type thing. Yeah, you could have like broke this up in like between the tracks. I was, I was thinking the same thing. All right, so the song, first song that we got officially, America's Most Wanted. America's Most Wanted. Tell the police reports and scanners we've been branded. Killers, drug dealers, you name it. Hello and Cadence Wise, do we sound like Andre 3000? I am a man. I think it's more of his voice. I think his voice kind of sounds like Modern day times, we flooded with dollar signs, but the black man mind is never at peace. But uh, that track, um, that track was alright. Like, I think I kind of, I have a couple of issues. You gonna talk about it then? I'm gonna talk about the end, yeah. Okay. Alright, so next song we got is called Untitled. Boys, they acting on one accord, want to discard my life. They don't know I'm not home, ready to end too dirty. It's time for me to deploy and make an intervention. A new invention, lingerie, the child, the camera can keep the focus. Hennessy may numb the pain, but it's become ever clear that our place in society is clear cut. Society okay, like I, 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 saw guts, I saw what you did there. But it, it's like spoken word and rap at the same time. Like I feel like after each like song, I feel like after each song, I'm supposed to get down do this. Right, so it's so it's a rap. Yeah, okay, it's so, technically yeah. It's but a rap. Next song we got Mental Thousand One. It's a freestyle, so yeah. Mental Thousand One. I'm I'm just saying all the comments for the end. Man, believe me, it's on the tip of my tongue. I gotta run. Well, pause that. Tell me why the Even fuck I thought not. this shit was by the Earl Game while they come on for a second. I thought that was you the nigga. What? Uh, I think the dude with the dress. Which one is he? I think that's Venus. I don't know. I keep forgetting. Them. But the nigga with the dread, that's how that nigga be talking. Like, if you get that thing with the free stuff. I, I don't, I can't, yeah, I couldn't tell the difference, but yeah, I was getting Earth Gang vibes too. Doubt and time see my downfall around 12 o'clock. I go to work, but every single day, I shouldn't have never sold my soul, but I did it just for a dollar. Now I'm just trying to live. You see, be headed. You wouldn't be believing what we had it. This is fake. This baby really exists. You can't even like force a ball. Like, you, you, you're not supposed to ball to this. You're not. You're just supposed to sit here and listen. So the next song we got is called Scene One. I feel like it's a skit. It's a skit. Like, damn, you gonna leave us hanging like that? So, this song we got is called Allegory and Interlude. I swear, this shit sound like my damn lo fi selection. 
But he equipped, you see family the mean fuck? nothing. It's just a word. The the fuck 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 lies matter. What is that? Black versus white. For they can get slack. It's probably funnier than flapjack. I mean black so black in the slavery. My own brother made a slave set us. But I guess you wanted it all. Paul called. So after the flapjack. day, I won't see another fall. Can't Every time my brother <laughs> into an enemy. No. I, we headed for self-destruction. You don't even care for the repercussions. That clout got your head clouded like many concussions. But instead of violence, how about a simple discussion? That wasn't simple at all. No, oh, niggas get shot at the end, so you know this finna lead to something else. <laughs> Alright, so the next song we got is called... What the fuck? It ain't working. It's called What the Fuck It Ain't Working. Let's get into it! Like, no, this shit really not working. Oh, well, shit, alright. Next song we got is Priority Policy. Yo, tell them I was singing that in my I head. I wish right now, wish right now, wish right now. You know, he been doing that shit when I think he about to rhyme and say some else, and I be like, you know what them killers do? He got that MF Doom going on. Hey, I, he be trying to keep dry vibes with him. Work hard and save your money or you'll end up like some dummy on the street corner That's laced up with clouds and nothing in his mind but marijuana And you're looking back at that all you could have been Juana But you should have added it up and saved your money instead of blowing it every time you made it Oh, you got angry with this one Okay I'm James and I'm a simple man just looking for Mary Jane I had the tales from the center, I hope I remember the same Me too, me vindicated name. Second chart we got, it's called Note Note to you Sticking with their families, never fornicating, no matter how many women are being naked. Don't want cake, all friends who I don't know if I can agree with that view, but you know, I respect it. I before that message come through, after you come through, you know, the one that starts with I'm overdue. Lost. So I don't know why I like that so much. I really don't. It was a uh, pretty much a note to you, deadbeat fathers out there. You need to do better. Basically, okay. I'm all right, go. so we got scene two coming right up. I would just want to hear what we at all in my knee kickers before no. This an angry old man. He is always coming to my home before I call the cops. <laughs> Next song we got is called Mental Thoughts 2 Freestyle. Now I'm back for freestyle number two on the same album. I guess I'm over. Tell me why I thought it was Jig. Be like society, they'll be over you. I thought it was Jig. I'm just picturing myself like laying out in a grassy plain while the wind blow. <laughs> just having this shit play in the background. <laughs> I know how to move the sticks I and the it. porcupine. I heard They labeled us by society standards. We don't even get the standard grade curvature. What you know about that curvature? Alright, the next track we got is called Chains and Shackles Part 1. Interesting title. Can't move freely. My brain by the TV. Graphics and on my brain. This kid's still at yep. kill it with no hesitation. Marijuana illegal, that's medicinal medication. Yeah, thank you. And now we're on American Dream. I feel like uh, Cole and Kendrick about to make a surprise uh, pop up. And Kendrick finna get washed. They surrounded by a bunch of hate. Let's see if you can relate and finally understand. He's going, he's going so many places at one time. Like the dark side, like Mace with the wings. I heard this is another freak where I want to be the outside. Still alive. So you an ATL in your life? This ain't the American Dream. Okay. Black man on the pose to be by Ani. Right here is Onyx, but I can't graduate middle school about hooked on phonics. You see the issue crying, you're a ripper, never asked for a tissue. Last and final track in Eternal Enlightenment. That's it, that right? Internal Enlightenment. Yeah, it's eternal, eternal, eternal it's, it's, it's Enlightenment. Eternal Enlightenment. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, enlighten me. Time every second precious, kind of like that movie. My woke versus war by those dead and hearses. Enlightenment to the soul. Oh, I get it. My yeah. You need part of the 
you with this little peace of mind Trying to give you a peace of mind That's why I put my heart and soul into these lines Paying all kinds of All right, so that was 1641 by uh, Daquan Mabane Mabane I don't know if I'm saying it right Mabane How you feel about it? All right yeah, so, I, 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 it's your first day at, uh, uh, on a college campus, right? You're a freshman. You're new. You're uh, walking to your first class, right? Okay. Uh, you're going through the Union Center or Student Hall or whatever they want to call it, right? Student Center? Yeah, that. Yeah. You see a kid standing across the room. He's handing out flyers. Now, this kid, he got probably some black uh, jeans on, a dashiki, uh, earring, probably made out of bamboo. He spots you, looks dead in the eye, and he walks up to you. Brother, let me tell you the date. Let me just take five minutes of your time, all right? That's what I felt like listening to this album. <laughs> I'm not finna lie. Like, no offense, but that's what I felt like. I felt like. You feel like it was too preachy? Yes. You feel like, yeah, you feel like it was too preachy. I now, felt like it was one of those African American club people coming up to you to tell you how you're being deteriorated in America, which but, I don't have a problem with. My issue was is that it was too. Uh, straightforward to for for my for my liking to be honest. So like it, like, it was <clears> like <throat> on some Kendrick Lamar shit, but Kendrick Lamar was is less preachy. It's like you know, it's like you know what he was trying to do, but the execution. Wasn't, yeah, it wasn't yeah. all the way there. That's why at first I was like, I see he has an idea, but I don't think he's very. I don't think he's presenting it as well as he think. Like the whole documentary thing was dope, right? It was. So take for instance, uh, I need to Google what happened in sixteen forty one. Sixteen. I don't know why I feel like it has something to do with slaves coming over and landing at God damn it, I think that is sixteen forty one. Plymouth Rock didn't land it on yeah, us. I really think yeah but on us. But uh the scene, I think with the interlude was seen too. Uh, they was talking about there's no such thing as a white on white crime, and he was like, "Oh yes, it is. There's also white on black crime." All right, that's a good topic to convey in a song instead of in a scene or just saying it out there. Like a lot of the topics that he was talking about, I felt like he could like conceptualize it and made it more listenable instead of it being just him literally talking to you and telling you what it is. I feel because that's the thing about what music is like. Yeah, you can have a good message in your music, but if nobody can't vibe to you, what's the point of having a good message? I mean, I feel like production. I actually I ain't even gonna like. I like. The, I actually like the production on it. I mean, the production on it. Production on cool. real. A little bit sleepy. It's a little bit too sleepy because a lot of these beats are the type of beats I play when I just want to like chill out and go to sleep. Boom bap. It, it like it got the boom. It's like a more subtle boom bap feel. But then again, it depends on what you're going for. And I feel like I mean, and your audience at the same time. But even with his type of audience, I still don't think the idea that he was going for was executed that properly. Cause you mm. take niggas like Cole and Kendrick for example, like they literally rap about the same shit, but they conceptualize it to that we don't know they're actually rapping about it until we go back and listen to it again or a third time, like. To be honest, I can listen to this whole album straight through for the first time and know everything you're talking about. Because he just told me everything he was talking about. In I, the last song. Hell, he damn sure damn near told me the whole album in the first part. Damn. The prelude. Yeah. Like, you speaking can't of that, that, you can't. Speaking of that, prelude <coughs> was oh, that. That, that, issue. that, it was too long. That intro was too long. Kind of like how, or uh, who, who did that shit? Cozy Boys? The Bro, cozy taste one. No, they had them long. They had the long. They had the long. I mean, at least they were funny. Yeah, at least they was. I mean, his was his was serious. It was more serious. But right, right. I feel like yeah, that part could have been like broken up. Like you could have had like each part under, like or behind each track and listening yeah. so it all comes together at the end. I think that would have been a I mean, better I, fitting instead of like putting it all on one track. I don't really. I don't know. I don't really. I got no problem with it for real. Some of the stuff that we not already named for real. Now, one thing I can say, I like. The flow, I like his flow. I like the actually, I actually like the way he raps. Now, does it? I don't. The thing, about, it's different. It's different. Yeah. It, not too many people rap like this, so he it, it, he stands out. And it, the Andre three thousand comparison, like. See the whole with the whole and the cadence Andre, thing. I don't know. He I can does that. With that. You, it's hard. It, it's, it's hard, hard to, to bother head to. That's my thing. But he does that on purpose, though. So it's 
It don't he, matter if you do it on purpose if nobody's going to listen to it. How you know? How do you know? Nobody's going to listen to it. Where, where, where you see this game played at? This just came out. This where is, is an up-and-coming artist. Where you see this game played at? MF Doom. If you MF, have, Doom, MF Doom. Has, we MF, have a lot of up-and-coming artists. MF Doom has, has a cult fan base. He does not sound like MF Doom. M- 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 MF Doom rap, M- MF Doom kind of got that off cadence and rap style. Matter of fact, I'm glad you said MF Doom. Take MF Doom for example. MF Doom is uh, known to be one of the greatest lyricists to ever do it in hip hop. Not one MF Doom song you can listen to straightforward and tell me you know what he's talking about off the first listen. I can do that perfectly with this nigga, per- perfectly. And I'm not trying to like shit on the project or nothing. I'm just trying to convey. In a musical aspect, I mean, I'm I talking see, I mean, straight I see, I see, music. I see, I mean, I see what you're saying. I just, I don't know. Like it's good with a message, but hell, if nobody's around to hear the message, is the message gonna get heard? Yeah. But Damn. oh, I feel like yeah. he's a work in progress. Like yeah, like take this idea and work on it and tweak it and conceptualize it to make it actually I a feel little like, bit more I, listenable than just talking over a bunch of boom bap beats. You still got, you still, it's like you, you still trying to find this sound. Yeah, find yeah. your sound. I w- I would say. Yeah, that. Trying, I mean, but this is a this is a solid project. It's solid to me. Thirty one minutes. It was okay. Quick, you know. Too many skits. This is um, this is this is like first official like. Party I think this is, this is like first official, but like. Uh, well, first official project. I mean, it's to be honest, really solid. To I me. like the I, I like his ideas, so I don't want to make it seem like I'm shitting on the whole project. I like I, mean, I not, like his ideas. <laughs> And I just think the ideas need to be worked out a little bit more and better before he puts out another full body of work. Because with this one, I like the whole documentary concept. I do it just, you know, make it a little bit more, I it's guess, a, enjoyable. It's not a documentary, it's a documentary. Document. My bad. A, documentary. Doc- a documentary. Yeah, but that's all I really got to say about it, yo. Keep doing your thing. Keep pushing. Uh, my bane. My bane. Keep pushing. Um, I like... Like I said, I don't know. I don't really have too many problems with this. For real, it's different and shit. So, yeah, man. Please, like, subscribe, comment, send us your music. Send us your music. We're even taking product. We're even taking producers now. So, like, we taking producers. Yeah, might as well. You know, we taking producers. We taking now. producers now. So, like, yeah, producers send us beats and shit. So, like, we'll listen to those too. And like, you know what I'm saying? Just yeah. Alright, so, but, yeah, uh, be sure to send those to me or him, like I said, like, subscribe, comment, be sure to, you know what I'm saying, hit that notification bell so I can get a notification next time I put up a video, but yeah, man, this is TNJ, leaving y'all with another fresh out the oven, thank you. What? This shit's fresh out the oven, whip game cold, man, this shit about the bubble, big bank rolls, either hate it or love it, if anything goes, this is long as